Hi everyone, so today I just wanted to do a quick video to ask a favour. Now I know I have quite a few of American and Canadian friends on YouTube and you always leave me nice messages and I love it. Um, but I wanted to, to say, to ask kind of anyone that watches my little rambly videos, um, really long and short of it is that the start of October me and my husband and two of our friends are going to be going over to Toronto for three nights then we're going to Niagara Falls for two nights and then we're going to be going on um, getting a message in the middle of this video, never mind. So I'm going to be going on to um, New York for five nights. Now, I've been to New York before. This is going to be the fourth time that I'll be going there. But Canada, none of us from the uh, people that we're going with have been to Canada before. So I've been trying to look up um, different places to go, you know, different things to see, like touristy sort of stuff, different places to see, different shops to go to. And I've just been trying to research it because obviously we don't really have an awful lot of time there so that being said I've made a list on my phone of things that I'm after and I kind of know to a certain extent where I'm going to to get them but I just want any info of anything that you can kind of help me with so there's the list of things I'm just going to run through it just in case you're wondering what I'm after buying so the first thing is the Liz Wartier colour correction wheel I've already got one of them it's my favorite thing ever but I'm running out of one of the colours so I want to go and and get another one. Now I've been told that either winners or shoppers in Canada are the place for me to go to and I can't for the life of me rem remember which one so if you could let me know that'd be ace. Um, I also want to get peanut butter M&Ms you can see that that's important so that's near the top of the list. The next one is wet and wild blush just a, a note that I thought that the heather pink uh, heather silk one looked gorgeous. I also want to get a Freedom palette um, by Inglot so I'm guessing I'm going to get that in New York. That's another thing that I wanted to ask. I'm not trying to be cheap by saying this but things like that I don't know if Inglot is in Canada but if it is is it better me buying it in Canada or better me buying it in America? What's, what's going to be cheaper for me? Obviously, the more I can save, the more I can spend um, on other stuff. So I've also made a note, I think that this is New York, though, um, Henry Bendel. Sounds like it's a good shop. Um, I also want to go to Victoria's Secret. Now, I know that they are in Canada. Again, is it better for me to go in Canada or America? Is the um, Canada shops different price-wise or anything like that? So, yeah, I want to go to Bath & Body Works as well. Same question, is it better for me to buy most of my stuff in New York? or in Toronto. Um, another thing that I want to buy actually is I'll have a look at at least the Coach mini saddlebags. I have seen a picture online on the Macy's website and it looks gorgeous so I'm interested in that. Or I've made a note as well that the um, have a coach and eating centre in Toronto because I really quite fancy having getting a Willis bag or at least a mini Willis bag. Another one that I'm after is um, the Nine West fair and square bags or at least they look nice on online anyway and then the last thing so far because this list will end up being huge is um, look at the Kate Spade bags because you can't get them here and I've had a look and Bloomingdale's for example they don't ship Kate Spade to the UK so obviously anything that I want to buy I'll definitely need to get over there because I can't even pay to have that shipped here so that is the list so far there was something else that I wanted to ask you um, and do you know what, for the life of me, I, I can't think of it. It's just gone out of my mind completely. But yeah, I just really want ideas for anything, um, anywhere, any places for me to go to in Toronto. For a certain part of the time, it's just going to be me and my husband, as our friends are going to be meeting up with some different people. So it's going to be just me mooching round. I don't know if that's an English term, but mooching round, just trying to find out different things like that. Now, I'm going to sit and have a think of what else I was going to ask you. Oh, it's all come to me now. I was going to say to you that 
Um, I might do a little bit of filming while I'm over there. I don't know how fun it's going to be or how much I'll actually be able to film. But I thought that if anything good happens or anything fun, that I might actually make like a little video for you to see when I get back. So if you're interested in that, let me know as well. Leave a comment below. Thanks for listening to me waffle. As I said, please, 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 if you can think of anywhere, any shops to recommend to me, um, if you can tell me where they're going to be in Toronto and like downtown Toronto, then that would be brilliant because I'm absolutely going to be useless without it but thanks very much for watching